Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're gonna drop off some packages. Ooh, packages. <laughs> and we're gonna go thrifting. Yay for thrifting! Uh, we're gonna go to a Goodwill we've never been to before. So hopefully we'll find some good stuff there. It's a little bit away, so. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. You like my hair? All right, I'll see you guys there. So I'm about to be candid with y'all. We really don't have the money to be spending on Goodwill shopping. But you know, <laughs> it's really addictive. So just watch out for that. It's bringing me my chips. By the way, this is the other half of the new castle. That's the husband. Isn't he gorgeous? <laughs> yeah. So later today we're gonna post a picture of these Hello Kitty shoes we found. We think they're vintage. They're like all suede. 2003 on the tag. Yeah, 2003 all suede. They're super cute. They're pink. But we know nothing about them. We can't find any comps on them. So if you guys know anything about them or you're a Hello Kitty fan, please let us know. I'm gonna post on the Instagram, drop a comment. That'd be great, thanks. So what brands are we gonna be looking for today? Well, I'm gonna be looking for some vintage stuff, some vintage t-shirts, maybe a vintage sports pullover or something, sweater, sweatshirt. Um, and I want, I'm actually looking to do a shoe restoration. So I'm gonna see if I can find something not too pricey to restore. This, this could be my first full restoration. I've done a couple in the past, but just minor stuff. This one I want to do a full restoration on. Okay, and we're thinking about actually making a video about rest, restoration, restoring shoes. I know there's a lot out there and we think they're really cool, but I think it'd be nice to do it. Uh, today, I'm going to be looking for I don't know, just clothes. <laughs> I'm kind of done shopping for shoes because they take so long for me to sell. I don't know if I'm looking for the wrong ones or what, but I'm done. Unless they're Keens or, what's the other shoe? Chacos. Unless they're Keens or Chacos. Yes, Kieran. And also we'll show you what we do when we have 202 and we're shopping for stuff in the store, it can get kind of crazy and people get tired and cranky and screaming. So we'll just show you what we do when we do go shopping. Here's the story. Uh, we went ahead and GPS uh, Goodwill, but it wasn't actually a Goodwill store. It was actually a Goodwill, like a, a donation center. So we went to the wrong place, but fortunately in the parking lot, there was a thrift store, so we ended up just stopping over there. And it was okay. Uh, we picked up a couple things. Um, I'll show you what we got. So the first thing we got is uh, some maternity pants. And uh, my wife says they sell really good, so she picked those up. And then I got a really cool find, a nice vintage NFL pullover. Uh, Oakland Raiders. Uh, just got one spot on I'm going to clean up, but it's a really cool vintage. Uh, over here and what's really cool it's got this little detail this little trim that says Raiders on it that's really cool I um, think that'll sell really good on my vintage page just got a laundry put that in the laundry so uh, so we're gonna go actually head off to the real Goodwill and then uh, we'll see you there so we finally made it to the correct Goodwill as you guys can see it's huge we're just gonna get the kids out the car unload them give snacks all that good stuff parent life. Alright, so this place is huge. I don't even know where to begin. Y'all, look at this. Mountains. Vast, vast valleys of clothes. Oh my god. Alright, so this is what we do. You give this one snacks and games. And this one, you just unbuckle her and we carry her when we need to. Say hello. <laughs> yeah. 
let's get shopping. Alright, so game plan going forward is to have a game plan <laughs> before I go in there and get completely overwhelmed because I know what I'm looking for but then I don't. I see a lot of stuff that looks cool but isn't really, you know, valuable. Musical. So. <sighs> the new game plan is to look at shorts because summer's coming and I know shorts will sell. They sell very good on my Poshmark and oh no what's wrong I fed you I promise I did so here we have shorts the color of today is red Oh, those are for tiny, tiny people. <laughs> you guys ever heard of this brand? I don't know. So, look at shorts and then we'll look at maternity shorts because, like I said earlier, they always sell. Oh, well, these are sparkly. Yes, Corbear. Alright, we're looking. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, found some skirts. This one is a tag on. gorgeous. Yes, it still has a tag on it. I think I'll get that one because I don't have anything like that in my closet. It looks really pretty. Uh, these are a whole bunch of loft skirts. Only one is on sale. I don't know how well they'll sell. I know Loft is a pretty good seller, but with skirts, $4 a piece, it's, it's a hit or miss sometimes. This one, I like, turn it around, because the buttons is really pretty. And I don't know, winter time's almost over, that might not be the best buy. And this one, look at this pattern. Front. Yeah, look at the pattern. It's so pretty. So, I'll just walk around with these and decide by the end of which ones I'll buy. That's my process. So, this is what we do with him. The toy aisle. And in the toy aisle, we found these. These are golf balls. Uh, these especially, we looked up the comps on eBay and it's 22 for one pack of these. So this is potentially $80 right there. We also found these, but we couldn't find anything on them. We're debating if we want to get them or not. Uh, they're going for $10 for a four pack. And this. Um, yeah, she's 1976. XL90, $10 for 12. Eh. We'll pass on these. Yeah, those other ones should be better. A little core bear sleeve. Yeah. Look at that sweet face. It's such a wonderful age where they can just uh, they can just sleep, sleep, sleep. Ooh, look at this. This is interesting. Look at the comps on this. This good well ain't bad. It is not bad. Okay, so we found some Echo sandals. And they're dirty, as you can see. But we are really good at cleaning up shoes. And I mean, look at the bottoms of these. Pretty much brand new. These are going for about 40 on eBay. Pre-owned. Now, I found this dress. It is plus size, it's cute, it's Meteor, never heard of it, it's still got tags on it, and it is in perfect condition. I think this will sell, I'm going to take a chance on it, but you guys, I really don't know, I don't know, but it's so cute and it's plus size. Found a little mini drug rug, 
I think it's about 2T. These uh, adult size sell very well, so I'm curious to see how much they'll sell for small size. But how cute is that? And now it's not, but not least, we've got this sweater and it's motherhood maternity. I saw this on Poshmark the other day and it was selling for like 30. It is so cute y'all, so cute. Excuse me. Oh, sorry. So I need to stop right here because it's getting out of hand at this point. Okay, so we made it unscathed. Minimal amount of breakdowns from the kids. And we spent too much money. Our total was $31. It's not bad. Hopefully we'll make a profit of about almost 200 from the shop. We found some really cool vintage items. Uh, next video, I'll show you guys what sold and how much it sold for. Uh, yeah, that's what happens when you come to Goodwill. No self-control. None whatsoever. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. See you in the next video. Bye. Bye-bye.